Welcome to the Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT. And I'm Mike the Explosive One. Let's crack into another one. TNT. Cracked. Uh, yes, that's it. End of show. Thanks for all the... Uh, Utah. Place to live. Okay, yeah. Mormonism. Love it. Yeah, dude. So, uh, polyamory. Poly- yeah. Poly- no, polygamy. Uh, polygamy, yeah. So, this guy goes into a bank. He writes them a nice little note. It's How many a, wives did he have? Uh, I don't know. It didn't say. Okay, fair. It said, his little note said, pardon me, I'm sorry for the inconvenience, but this is a robbery. I would like one dollar, please. And okay, okay. and they handed him the one dollar and yes. he took it and he said, you know, he said, please call the police. He went, he sat down in the lobby with his dollar waiting for the police to come and arrest him. And what happened? Did they please tell me they came and shot him? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, was this in America? Uh, yes. 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 Utah. <laughs> no, no, Utah isn't technically America. Utah, so. Florida. Uh, so anyways, so he's sitting there and it's taking the police a long time to come. And he's like, y'all are lucky. I don't have a gun because they're taking a long time to get here or whatever. At that point, they took everybody into the back or whatever, but they arrested him. And he said he wanted to go. He wants to go to federal prison. He said, if you do not put me in jail, I will come and rob another bank. I will ask for more money until you arrest me and put me in federal prison. Okay. So obviously I think he has some sort of like mental issues, right? But he's not being violent. Maybe. And my thought was, bro, you need the gun. The gun is how you get federal prison. If you go to rob somebody and you have a gun, that's yeah. way worse than just going in and being like, I'm I mean, robbing you hey, without. Hey, yo, if that's what it takes. That's what it takes. Yeah. And uh, he's like 60 some years old. And then I was like, so if I don't want to go in the nursing home. You, know, <laughs> you want to go to federal prison you instead? go to federal prison instead? No, they're going to take even worse care of you there. Are they? I mean, <laughs> I mean, what if what? Hey, what if you you're in? What point, if you want to be in a gang? What if you want to get? What if you want some some badus? <laughs> I don't know. At sixty years old, come on. <laughs> what are you gonna do? You're gonna be somebody snack in in prison. Somebody snack. You ever seen Oz? The, the it'll be they'll be like some old Nazi who just like comes up. He's like, you're my you're mine now. <laughs> like Ew. put you in his put you in his cell, but. Take your have your sixty year old ass dancing on a pole <laughs> in the prison pole. I, I Grab wanted, that bedpost. Now this is that's very interesting because I, honestly I wonder what like as soon as you said that uh, he he did this and he had so much intent on going to federal prison. I'm thinking like what could have caused him to go there? Okay, so mental illness is is one thing, but let's rule that out and say maybe he had a gambling debt. Oh no, he, he's. <laughs> but, but here's the thing. If That's well, I guess, I guess I guess it's how deep and connected you are. Because I'm like, they'll find you in prison. If it's like the mafia, they'll find you in prison. Oh well, yeah, hundred percent, hundred percent. But like, yeah, or yeah. My my first guess is he he's mentally unstable. Yeah. Th- that's probably what it was. But uh, yeah. what, my idea what, was my first idea was like, oh, this dude's got bills. What if he just got out of prison? And he's like, I gotta go back. I can't handle the real life. That was another thing. That was yeah. another thing. All my homies are in prison. It's the uh what's that guy from Shawshank Redemption? Brooks. But Brooks killed himself. He could have just went back to jail. But I don't remember a single person's name from that movie. Uh I just remember Morgan and Freeman. Dufresne. Nope. I don't all I remember is Brooks because he wrote Brooks was here on the wood before he hung himself. Oh yeah. yeah and then Morgan yeah. Freeman gets out and goes to the same hotel room that Brooks killed himself in. Yeah, it's like staying at the, the Epstein suite at the prison. Yeah, 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 yeah. So like yeah, that. yeah. I don't know, man. Going going to federal prison doesn't sound super fun. I guess it's probably better than like a state prison or something. I don't know. You're probably on lockdown, like twenty three hours a day, one hour of sunshine. I mean, ain't no sunshine. But still, you know, I figured that they, the prison would be like better taken care of. You make a valid point. And a lot of better, like, facilities. They probably have, like, the federal prison is going to have a nice gym, a yeah. track. <laughs> maybe. So, okay. So, what about this? Better so, food. So, you get, you're old, and you're like, okay, listen. So, you so you get a ton of credit cards, right? Sure. You run up debt after debt after debt. You Let's get, go. You get as much, because, like, while your credit is still good, before it all hits your credit report, yeah. you just get as much credit as they'll let you get. Yeah, I like free money. You yeah. run that up. Got you. You yeah. default all that stuff. C- complete uh-huh. fraud, bounce checks, like, whatever. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, 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 and yeah. And then you just, like, yeah, then you're like, I'll just go to federal prison. Don't matter. I'll be in there the rest of my life. Oh, yeah, I mean, But you, know. you live it up for however long until you get caught, <laughs> and then you go to federal prison. <laughs> 
He's so running. He, maybe he just doesn't like his wife or his boyfriend. He might be. So he might yesterday's be episode, we told you one <laughs> one loophole on how to have a thirteen year old girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> On today's episode, we're going to tell you a credit card fraud when you get to a certain age. Because <laughs> fuck it, who cares? <laughs> been an interesting week at the crazy town. <laughs> I guess I didn't even realize it's, that. It's, it's so funny because there was something I said this morning. You were like, uh, you just doing crimes or some sh- I don't remember. You said something about, like, I was like, uh... Champion. That does sound like something I would say, but I don't think that was this morning. There was something about me championing some somebody. Brownies this morning. That was good. I did buy brownies this morning, but uh, yeah, I, I'm not. A, I'm not an advocate for doing that, and I would never run up credit card no. debt. I don't think I could. I don't think I have the stones. I, and, and you know what's really interesting is like <laughs> there are people who do that, right? Yeah. Like I've just in great. I, I've had credit card debt in the past. I've always paid it off. I've never like whatever. Um. Actually, like most of the time, I pay almost all my bills on a credit card and just pay it off because I get cash back. So at least I might make a little bit of money back off of it, right? Um, but like, yeah, just the fact of like having all that. I feel like if you got like 30 credit cards in the same month yeah. before like they all hit your credit report and you purposely ran the debt up, I feel like that would be something they would like take you to jail for. Like that seems intentful. Yeah. The intent of deceit and fraud. And I, I think the, the delineation from you going to like just like city prisons versus like a uh, federal prison to be the amount that you do it yeah for. but no you do, that's why you rob the bank so you go to federal prison like uh, the debt is just a subsidiary of your of your thing what if they give you enough time for robbing the bank that in like a regular state run prison um so that it makes it not feel worth it to try to rob again <laughs> I don't know. It's like you rob because if you rob the bank and and then they're like you only rob them for a dollar. I'm just going to give you like six months and. Stay. Well, he said if he said that he would keep doing it. So like, yeah. so I'm sure like he goes to he goes to court and he's like, Your Honor, if you don't give me what I want, you let me out. The next day, I'm robbing another bank. Straight up, full of like just not yeah. even hiding what his intent is. That's crazy. Yeah, and he's like 67. I mean, what you got to live for at that age, anyways? There's a there's another story. I'm joking. That was a joke. You have plenty to live yeah. for at 67. <laughs> I mean, I, I you didn't even <laughs> say anything. I was like, oh, he's what just was I supposed to say? I kind of agree. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, there's a, I lo- I love you, Grandma. There's a story about a uh, a man, um, who who constantly keeps getting arrested by like just standing in traffic, and when the police pick him up, he doesn't say a word. And in court, he doesn't say a word. So he just stands there. Yeah. And they take him. They yeah. book him. He doesn't say a word. He goes to court, doesn't say a word. He does it yeah. again. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Just, and it's like a misdemeanor. It's not like you're really doing anything, right? Like, it's not. I yeah. wonder how many of those happen before you get put in jail. I mean, I don't know. Now, that one, I think, might be a mental thing. But it's hard to tell. Like, maybe he has, like, a, no- a normal everyday life. I don't know a lot about uh, about criminals and, and their behaviors. I'm, I've never been a criminal, Jonas. Yeah, I I've never been a criminal either. I Sometimes used to. I wonder about criminal minds. Dun, dun, dun. The show. <laughs> I used to steal cr- Cadbury eggs, and that was about it. Everything else Man, I paid for. A, that's. I mean, that's a criminal at heart. I mean, yeah. You're a criminal. <laughs> Boom. Bump, bump, bump. That's an Eminem song. You know? <laughs> criminal. What the hell? You goddamn right. You a criminal. Remember that? Yeah. Which is that? No, just like it. Is that your favorite Eminem song? Is, no. is that why you brought it up? No, it just it popped in my head because you were talking about criminals. Okay. <laughs> what? Is that not okay? It's not okay that I think of Eminem songs? No, absolutely not, man. It's perfectly fine. Uh, That's right. What? What? What's Don't your? What's, me. what's your favorite Eminem song? Oh, since you, since you brought it up there, big guy. Um, what is my favorite Eminem? Oh my god. I mean, I don't even listen to Eminem anymore at all. But like, uh, I liked. Uh, I like. I sit back with this bag and this six pack of this bag of this weed. It gives me the stuff needed oh, to be. Oh yeah, yeah. Be, be, I like. Um, be. Oh man, what song is a? Uh, it's my ish. God, is it a? Uh, probably that one where he sings a little. You bit. like my dad's going crazy. Yeah. You seem like I think yeah, my that's dad's it, yeah. going crazy yep, type I, it, of guy. No wait, no, no. I do like that song. No, it's uh, you do like that song. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, no, I like the one where he sings. He sings know, a little maybe. bit and then he's like da 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 rapping. You know that one? All right, fair. Yeah. It's on that same album. 
Okay, then. Everybody, listen up. I'm going to hell. Yeah, that's my dad's gone crazy. That's not the song I'm talking about, though. That song sucks. Well, I mean, I don't care if you think it sucks or not. I'm allowed to like what I want because I'm a grown A man in America. Children should never be allowed to sing. Uh, old people, Ever? Nope. Old people probably shouldn't drive. <laughs> dropping all the dropping all the boomerisms today. And uh, women shouldn't box. Shouldn't box? Or drive Uber the, after 10 o'clock. That one woman boxing match that we watched over at Pistol Pete's. Couchman Pete. Oh, that was a good dude. Match. Oh my god, that was a great. That was one of the best boxing matches I've ever seen. You're not even wrong, dude. <laughs> they stood in the ring in the match. last minute and just punched each other in the face for like 60 solid seconds. I was like, yeah. "What the f is happening right now?" Yeah, that uh, that was probably one of the best boxing matches. So I would have to say it's that I take that back because that was one of the best boxing matches I've ever seen. Yeah, <laughs> like maybe, ever. Maybe I'm wrong. At anyone, maybe so, maybe children should sing. Oh, uh, like on the Grinch cartoon. A change of heart right yeah. here live, <laughs> live. His heart grew three sizes. <laughs> Go to thecrazysound.com for Jonas. I think my dad's going crazy. <laughs> we out.